welcome to the 17th of May vlog and you may be asking uh, Chris isn't 17th of May just like a normal day <laughs> no it's not it's our national day it is Norway's 201st anniversary because last year was the 200th anniversary so yeah that's real cool and um, we have really we have a lot of traditions and stuff that we need to get done like wearing fancy clothes <laughs> so I decided that I need to show this to you Americans out there who doesn't know how 17th of May is celebrated and all the food and how we do it and songs and all that stuff and it's real fun so I decided to take you guys with me on this little adventure so yeah I need to get done dressed because I still have my national suit to go on top of this so I already look like a bubble <laughs> This is how it looks like so far, and the thing about these is that this is not like the official national suit of Norway because we have different ones from like where you are from. So I'm from the west coast, and that's where we have green ones, I'm pretty sure. And uh, up in north, we have more blue ones, I think, and down south, I think it's like red, but um, I'm not real sure about it. My sister got a red one, but uh. It's not from here, so. <laughs> but mine got made, it's like, it need to get handmade. It got made for me last year for my confirmation. And I also got this for my confirmation, which is like a box with a picture of me off and my name. And up in here we have the most expensive stuff that I have ever owned. It's so much expensive stuff. Like, you guys don't even know, it's like real silver. Silver, silver. And are those mine? Huh. Nice. And stuff. Yeah, nice. This <laughs> is a photo of me from 8th grade. And it got some glue on it because my aunt made it. It's, it's like handmade, so I like it. The look is complete. <laughs> I got all of like the stuff and these. Like this is like an entire belt and it's like a hundred dollars, a hundred dollars, a hundred dollars. So it's like really expensive. And then I got this thing to keep like my phone and all that and that stuff. And it got like my uh, initials. I don't know how to pronounce it. My, my name, my middle name, and my last name. And on the back, it's like the date of my confirmation. So that's cool. It looks like this. Nice. Okay, and here's my shoes. <laughs> uh, everything has to be so traditional. Okay, I'm going to try to show you guys the the flag in the mountain if you can see it there yeah i think you can actually see it it's a little bit smaller than last year and the year before but it's like really cool that people actually want to like go up in the mountains and there's like paint welcome to where i live everybody there's the flag and this is like where you drive in or whatever what is that oh, it's like a flower it's like a plastic flower this is just like I think this is just like a cheap flag that we got on the store and this flag is actually my grandpa's and he died when I was three years old from cancer so that sucks I need my ugly hat you guys may ask why but it's like a Norwegian thing and we usually just like have them on 17th of May so I need to bring it here's my sister's like stuff <coughs> oh my god okay Hi, Amalia. I give you a name. I don't know. Fuck, I'm not here. I'm not here. I'm not here. Okay, we usually have a marching band, but we don't have that this year. So we have a tractor and um, some loudspeakers. Extreme loudspeakers. Yes, yes. It's actually pretty fun to just like be on the playground. We don't have anything else to do. We'll never be as we are now. It's time to leave. It's all about getting wiped out. Let's see the Try to kill hundred little bitch with us. So fucking shit, bro. Us. The story behind the name bitch with us is that 
Amalia's little cousin, he came over with this like... <laughs> now they're fighting over it. He came over with this like little, little bug. And then he called it Bill Matthias because Bill is bug in Norwegian. And they keep fighting over it. And uh, then Amalie started calling him Mitch Matthias. And then this little girl, her cousin, his sister, she's like four years old. She was like, hey, Mitch Matthias. <laughs> oh my God. And uh, Hannah got like real shocked. And she was like, Amalie, you can't teach them these words. And Amalie was like, ha ah. ha. So that's basically what happened, yeah. I'm like so done right now. I just got home and oh my god, you have no idea how heavy this is. It's like an entire workout to wear it for a day. And it's like this is like a little bit too tight and the belt is way too tight. It was hard to close it to be completely honest. <laughs> yeah, and it's itchy too. It's like real itchy, but um I need to like take it off and um get into some comfortable clothes. And then I'm going to eat pizza and watch The Fosters on Netflix because that's my new favorite show and I think I have an obsession with it. <laughs> so thank you guys so much for watching this vlog. If you want me to vlog um, 17th of May next year then give it a thumbs up to let me know. And also subscribe to my channel if you haven't already. I am so close to 500 subscribers. It is so cool. Ah, yay! But um, thank you guys so much for watching and I'll talk to you next week. Bye! And you can't see the flag right now. Okay. That was my fault. I need to fix that. The hardest thing is to go upstairs. <laughs> I'm just like so terrified of like falling. I actually fell in the escalator yesterday. That was a horrific memory. Oh my god. <laughs> oh. You <laughs> cannot. <laughs> Ja, du är ju knäckt. Ja, du är 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 kn